In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to print from a database using Brother's free P-Touch Editor 6 software. So you can see here in the top left corner, I'm connected up to my label printer, the PTE310BT, and I'm going to print some patch panel labels from a database that I have prepared in Excel. So what you want to do is, from the main home screen, you want to select patch panel which brings up a number of ready-made label templates. So you've got 4-port, 6-port, 8-port and so on. But I'm going to select the 4-port template here, which matches up to the data that I need to input into the labels. Then click Create. So this next screen is essentially your label preview, where you're free to edit the contents, the positioning, the design of the label, label size and so on. Now we're going to go up here to the top right hand corner and click database. Open and then we're going to find the file that we want to import. In this case it's a CSV file. This one right here. So select that and press open again. And then you can see a preview of the data here. So if you press OK at the bottom of the screen, you can now see all of your data, it's pulled through. So in this case, I'm wanting to create six patch panel labels, each with four ports. What you want to do then, is merge the data with the text fields here, by simply dragging and dropping each column of data to the relevant text field. So hold your cursor over F1, and drag and drop into the first text field and then F2, F3, and so on. That's then created your six patch panel labels without having to input all of the data manually. So it's a real time saver. What we can do then is we can change the port spacing to suit our needs, depending on the width of the ports that you're working with. We can also change the style of the separator here. And then once you're happy with the layout, you want to highlight all of the data down here at the bottom and then press print. And here you have a preview of the complete job, so your six individual labels. Then, if that's all looking good, we can go ahead and press print again. The machine will then prompt you each time it's ready to cut the label, using the simple manual cutter here. Once the print job is complete, you'll have your six patch panel labels in order, ready to peel and stick down.